Welcome back. I had a uh, comment from Ali, and I'll show you the comment here. He says, thanks, I've been using Read Excel for a while and never knew there was a range argument. Then he wanted to ask about how to write to a specific tab, and I was thinking, okay, how do I do that? I looked it up, can't find it, can't find the answer anyway. Anywhere, so in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to use Open Excel, and it's actually pretty awesome. I think I've now, I'm going to switch to it, so let's take a look at what we can do with it, and I'll give the example to show how to write to a specific tab. And it's actually fairly easy, um, but you need a new package. So you can see I uh, click on Packages, Install, and let's go to OpenXLSX. OpenXLSX. So OpenXLSX, install that, and that does not require Java, I don't think, because it ran perfectly fine for me without it. So go ahead and install that, and then we'll just add that to our library. So library, OpenXLSX and run that code. Now, this is cool, so we're gonna create a workbook from scratch. We're gonna build a workbook, so we wanna create a workbook file. So workbook is equal to just plain create a workbook. Create workbook, and it's an empty, no parameters, and now that creates an object that's basically a Excel workbook, right? Now, what do we wanna do with this workbook? We wanna add a sheet or two, right? I wanna add some sheets, so add worksheet to which workbook? WB, the one I just created. And now I wanna name it, say we wanna name it um, first sheet. We can do first sheet and let's do this again and we'll do second sheet as well. So for my workbook object, add second sheet. Okay, so we run those two. Now nothing's created yet, but the object is still there and the object has been worked on, said, hey, add these two sheets. Now we wanna write data to a specific sheet. Let's write data to the second sheet only. So we're gonna use the uh, write data and we're gonna write data to what? The workbook object. The workbook object, write data to that. I wanna name the sheet that I wanna write, uh, write data to and that would be, uh, let's say second sheet. And then what's the data that we wanna write? I wanna put the iris data set in there, right? So if I command enter on that, this is not writing data to the file system. It's still writing data to that workbook object. So it's gonna say, take the second sheet, add the iris data set to that workbook object. Now we can save the actual workbook to the file system. And so we do that by using save workbook. So save workbook, and then which workbook, WB, and then we wanna call it, um, whatever you wanna call it, say my workbook, .xlsx. And then we can do override equals true, which will, if the file exists, it will uh, override it. If it does not exist, if it does not exist, it'll create it. But if you do override equals false and it does exist, you know you're gonna get an error. Um, and I don't know of a way to append anything yet. So the only way that I can think of to append files or append is to actually pull in, import that data, keep that held in some sort of object in R, and then create the object in its entirety appended within R, then write the entire thing back to um, Excel. So save workbook. Let's jump back over to my my uh, directory structure here where my project is, and I called it my workbook. Open that up. And you can see my first sheet down here uh, has nothing in it, but my second sheet, which I wanted to, puts the iris data set in there. Pretty cool. It works great. I think I'm gonna explore OpenXLSX next. I believe that it has more functionality and I think it's a lot cleaner way to do things. Create multiple workbooks. I feel like you can create an awesome workflow with this particular package. I hope I answered your question, Ali, and this hopefully helps you out. Let me know if you have any more questions. I appreciate that. Like and comment. Oh, just like Ali did. <laughs> Comment and I will like your stuff. I'll try to respond and I will try to create videos on demand if they are something that I can actually do. So see you guys in the next one.